What's up, Facebook fam? It's your boy, James R. Davis Sr. here, coming to you live this morning. <clears throat> I'm going to have a conversation, a very brief conversation with you guys this morning, man. It's kind of mind-blowing to me when I see stuff like this. But I got a question, man. As you guys can see the caption up above, mental illness is real on social media. You know, I want to speak. What's up? What's up? What's up? Good morning, Angela. I give I give Facebook time to, to build up the audience. I just want to I just want to expound on something real quick. Hopefully, it's going to help somebody this morning. Something that I see all the time. And uh, what's up, Renika? How you doing, sister? And uh, it's just, it's mind blowing to me that people do it. So mental, in the, mental illness is real on social media. Uh, let me explain that. You know, when I see, when I see people talk to Facebook, like Facebook is gonna talk back to you, that's a real mental, that's a real mental issue. Like, for an example, I was just, I, I rarely do this. I was scrolling through the feed this morning and I see it all the time, right? People who are in relationships. Like, why, <laughs> why do y'all curse Facebook out when you're speaking to your mate? I don't, I don't understand that. Like, what, what, what part of the game is that? What part of, you know, what, whatever happened to effective communication with your mate? Why are y'all posting stuff on Facebook towards your mate? Like, literally going off on Facebook. <laughs> as if your mate is going to read that, as if your mate even cares. Listen, let me tell you something, guys. Let me tell you ladies something. If you got to get on Facebook and voice your emotions on Facebook, you got a mental problem. Okay, you got a real serious mental problem. All right. What's up, Moe's? Mars Harris, what's up? Aren't you talking to Facebook? Yeah, I'm talking to I'm talking to people. I'm talking to you guys. I'm talking about people who post on Facebook. Bitch, your mama's sister's dog, cat down the street, ain't shit, blah, blah, blah. Or, you know, why do y'all talk to Facebook like that? I'm, I'm trying to understand. <laughs> who the hell are y'all talking to when you post on Facebook, right? Arguing with Facebook. Like Facebook don't talk back. Who who the hell y'all talking to, man? Like that's not a good look, especially to the to my queens out there. Y'all y'all looking desperate as hell, posting to your to your man on Facebook. Like that's crazy. Like what 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 part of the game is that, man? Help me understand that. That's crazy. I I, I don't get that. I've seen that happen as well. They don't understand the concept <laughs> of communication to their mate. Like, mental illness is real on social media, man. Why do y'all talk to Facebook like that? I'm trying to understand. What makes you go, what makes you so, uh, what makes you so mad that you get on your phone and you go, uh, you just type, uh, you mad as hell, it, and then it, it goes out to the whole world to see. Do y'all realize y'all look like, y'all look really, really stupid doing that? Stop posting all your damn personal business on Facebook. And it's actually somebody I know personally. Hopefully she catches this video and see this and be like, okay, let me let me put myself in check. Because like that, y'all look mentally retarded doing that. Like, come on, man. <laughs> What's really going on? Like, it, is that a trend now? Is that the new trend now? You know, you y'all tough on Facebook. Y'all curse your man all out on Facebook. Like, on Facebook. It's, I'm, I'm blown away by that. Like, <laughs> I'm trying to figure that one out. I'm trying to figure that one out. Can somebody help me with that? What, what is that all about? Posting to your, posting on Facebook to your, to your mate. I, I don't, I don't get it. Like, I see people having a conversation on Facebook. Nobody's responding. Nobody's liking. But they're communicating. They're going off on their boyfriend or their mate on Facebook. Like, <laughs> what part of the game is that? 
Look, guys. Watch what you eat, watch what you drink, because something is obviously in the water, something is obviously in the food. For people to go on social media, you mad at your boyfriend in the next room, but you go on social media and then you post some shit about what y'all going through. Mental illness is real on social media. Like, for real. And I'm just trying to figure out why... Why are we? Why? Why are we? Why are we arrived to the point where we speak to social media when we should be speaking to an individual? Makes no sense to me. It makes no sense. No sense whatsoever. So, ladies, ladies, I know a lot of y'all like and respect my kings and queen posts. Stop. Okay. Stop doing that. That really makes you look foolish to, to say the least okay stop posting your relationship business on facebook especially if you cursing people out on facebook like that's that's you have a you have a real ser serious mental problem okay when you think about that when you think about how when you get mad you get emotional you go on facebook and you post something towards somebody specifically but you post it on facebook you got a mental problem. Something, all, all your screws is not, not tightened up too tight. Y'all need some help. So stop doing that. I mean, listen, if you're a friend of someone who does that, pull their coattail, guys. That's not a good look. It's not a good look. You know what I'm saying? Not a good look at all. Please stop it. I just wanted to hop on real quick this morning, share that with you guys. That's that's really disturbing when you see in supposedly intelligent professional women on here talking, cursing out Facebook, specific, specifically talking to somebody, but they post it on Facebook for the whole world to see. <laughs> Yo, I mean, my my brain is trying to wrap around some comp, some sense into that, and it's not. I'm, I'm not able to put any sense into that. Like, so, so I just wanted to hop on real quick. I know a lot of you guys, you know, uh, uh, reach out to me and ask for advice and different things of that nature when it comes to your relationship. Like, I'm a relationship counselor. I'm not. I'm just a realist. But please, ladies, I don't really see a lot of men do it, but I see a lot of ladies do it. A lot of ladies do it. Can y'all please stop posting cursing Facebook out when you should be talking to your mate? Okay, so y'all share this video because somebody needs to see this. Please share this video. Please share this video. You all you're doing is exposing your mental illness. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh my god. Like Sean said, insecure women do that. Obviously, obviously, they're insecure that's doing that. And it's it's a, it's a bit it's a bit more than that. You know, people y'all need some help out here for real. Ser you need some serious help. If your ass get mad enough, you go on your phone, you mad enough at your man, but you go on your phone and you pour and you post what you should be saying to your man. You post it on Facebook. You are you have a mental issue, okay? Get you some help, please. Get your ass off Facebook, first of all, and go get you some help. You need to understand number one. He don't he don't he don't give a fuck about you, obviously, <laughs> okay? So he's not gonna see it, and even if he does see it, he doesn't care. He don't care. He's fucking somebody else. Excuse my French. All right, and if it hurts, say ouch, get over it. But please stop, ladies, stop. Please post it. Your anger <laughs> towards your man on social media. Talk to your man, okay? Talk to, and not 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 just for women who talk to men. I see I see people who do it to other people. You know. People speak to their family members on Facebook, cursing them plump out on social media as if they're talking to the person. 
Y'all got to cut that out, man. For real. Because y'all look super stupid and you have look like you really have some serious mental issues. So again, man, I'm just trying to help y'all out, man. Stop doing that. If you do that, stop doing that. I'm seeing 40 and 50 year old grown ass women. Grown ass women in their 40s and their 50s. On social media. Cursing out a man. On social media. Blows me away. As much love and respect I have for my queens, like, y'all got to stop doing that. That's not a good look, okay? Have I not said that enough? So I'm going to end this now, but I'm just blown away, man. Y'all, you know what's crazy? Most, y'all have really stopped me from scrolling through the feed. Two, re really, for a few reasons. One, half y'all can't freaking spell. <laughs> like, I be trying to figure out what your post says. Can't figure it out because of your wording. You don't use commas. You don't use capital letters. You don't use any of that. Another reason is because people literally get on here and emotionally voice their emotions on Facebook to people, to individuals. Like, who the fuck are y'all talking to? Who are you talking to when you get on Facebook and you curse Facebook out? But you speaking to somebody else. First of all, you are a coward. <laughs> like, come on, man. Why? Anytime I ever have beef with somebody, I took it up with that individual. I, why would I why would I go on a public platform and post my beef with a person over here on a social media platform? That's a mental problem, folks. Y'all got a mental, mental, mental problem. And like Mo said, who cares? No, nobody cares when you post that on, on social media. People are like laughing at your ass. People are laughing at you. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> I know we become a society where we don't care what people think about us and all this kind of stuff. That's fine. If you want to keep on talking to Facebook like a damn retard, keep right on. But it's not a good look. And I'm seeing my sisters who are in their 40s and in their 50s who I know personally. I'm not going to call you out, but I know y'all personally. And it's just... I'm going to tell you guys something, man. It just shows how miserable your life really, truly is. So stop putting yourself out there like that, okay? Can y'all please stop doing that? Please stop doing that. You know, it depends on how you look at it, Moe's Harris. You know, social media, can you can look at it as, it just depends on your perception, your level of perception. Some people's level of perception is social media is destroying, destroying society and all this kind of stuff. I don't look at it like that. You know what I'm saying? It has its people that do that. But for me, social media has been a blessing. I built huge businesses on social media. So it really depends on your level of perception, you know, how you see things. Uh, but social media, is, it, it, it definitely has that component to it where you have people that use social media and for not for, for good. You know what I'm saying? And it, it literally exposes the, the 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 mentality of people out there it really exposes your level of confidence whether you believe in yourself or not your self-esteem a lot of women have issues with self-esteem and it really shows on social media really shows i'm talking about is it, is it, 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 and it's sad it's sad man and y'all wonder why y'all can't have a successful relationship or, or a successful marriage you, you put the wrong things out there into the environment, so therefore you attract the wrong things, and then you wonder why you're attracting the same things that you've been attracting all your life. You know what I'm saying? So y'all stop doing that, man. Stop, 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 stop. Not a good look. I got love for my sisters, and some of y'all look desperate as hell on social media, and you look retarded as hell on social media. Voicing your emotions when you should be voicing it to the individual, okay? So that's just my quick two cents tip today. We talk about making no money, none of that. That's just disturbing, man. It's really disturbing to see that. You know what I'm saying? And I just feel like I need to really speak on it. Y'all share this video. Somebody hope somebody get value out of it. Y'all know I love y'all, man. James, I've seen sign out. Peace.